morning guys and welcome back to my channel today I am doing a back to school sort of haul it's basically just everything I bought at home all summer it was like two or three trips so yeah let's just get into the video okay so we are starting off we'll start off with this stuff because I didn't try this on since like it's not appropriate for a try on in my opinion so I got a new pair of Nike Pro spandex which they changed them up they look like they feel a lot better quality than their old ones so yeah I realized that all my old spandex were smalls and you girl it's not a small anymore so I got a pair of mediums and then I got a little bralette relax lounge bra thing from Calvin Klein which I have some that I got from Marshalls a little while back, but like this band here is only up to above the word. So I think this is going to be a whole lot nicer. Okay, so now we'll start with the clothes and what I actually tried on. Why am I talking while I'm turning? So from Kohl's, first I got this little spaghetti strap top. This is from the Jennifer Lopez part of Kohl's. Yeah, it's just cute. This is like my favorite color and whenever I wear green like this, my eyes look the exact same color. So yeah, I like this. And I have a pair of like really tight bottoms or like kind of like jeans, but not. It looks like a romper when you tuck this in. So I love this guy. So cute. Also from Kohl's, I got two shirts that are the exact same, but just different patterns. So first I got this black, it's literally just a button up shirt with like a fake pocket there and like rolled up sleeves. I got this tour to work because we had to wear button ups with collars and it had to be that. So I got that and they were on like super sale. So since I really like the fit of it, I also got it in this pink and white flowered pattern. Um, but yeah, this I just actually wear cause it's cute. No, actually wear the black one. I also got a pair of dress pants for work from Kohl's, but you guys don't need to see my work pants. And they're kind of gross, because working at a restaurant and your clothes get gross. And then from Nordstrom Rack, I got, oops, backwards. I got this blazer, oh my god, the sleeve is tucked in. This blazer, here we go. Which, it's just really cute flowers, it's like capri length sleeves, three quarter sleeves, that's what you say when it's a shirt. And yeah, it's just, just a blazer. Which, it's an extra small, which, like, I'm not an extra small, but it works, so we're good. I also got these shorts, which they're pleated, they just tie in the front, kind of looks like a skirt, kind of not. They're uber high-waisted, which you'll see, and these are from the brand Free Press, and these are mediums. And then lastly from Nordstrom Rack, this is from Love Fire, I got this dress which is just collared it's not cooperating right now just a collared dress a little button up and it goes straight down it's supposed to fit like absolutely skin tight and this is the only one they had left and I liked it so like I picked it out but it's literally an extra large but I like the fit of this where it's like tight in your larger areas like your chest and your bottom but in between it's looser okay so then Zara which Zara is my favorite store right now and probably will be for a while. It's, oh, I love Zara's clothing. So first I got this box dress, literally just green dress goes straight down. And I'm showing it to you backwards, but it really doesn't make a difference. And the sleeves are kind of cool. Just like, it's kind of like that. I don't know. But this is probably my favorite item of clothing that I got because I worn it so much already because I got this in the beginning of the summer. Also from Zara, it's another similar style dress, but it's a lot lighter weight. So it just has a pocket and it goes real long, real long. It's like a rusty color and it's really loose fitting. It's supposed to. And I got this one in a small, which it still fits how it's supposed to, but I would have gotten a medium if they had it. But I like this because it's, I just, I love like t-shirt dresses because they're comfy, cute, and you can put a whole outfit together just by throwing on a giant shirt. Zara, again, these are a size medium. I got these khaki shorts, which are so cute. Love these, love these. We love these. 
Um, they just have pleats. They're uber high-waisted, which as you can tell, I really like high-waisted. They've got fake pockets because what's new? They actually have real pockets in the front though. So that's cool. And then I got basically kind of the same thing, but in pants form. So we got these. And again, pleated, they're super wide-legged. Oh, what do they call these? Uh, I don't know. My mom said that they had these when she was a kid and they called them something, I don't know, but they were just super wide-legged. And they're pretty loose in the waist, which if you're like me and you have a larger bottom but a small waist, it's hard to find clothes that fit. So you just kind of have to accept that it's going to be big in the waist and either deal with it, wear about something because you just, you got to deal with it if it want, if you want it to fit and actually go over your butt. So that's it from Zara. And then I went to a thrift store near me called Red, White, and Blue and I got more work clothes. And I also got this. It is a button up, a little bit cropped. It's got pleats down like the side-ish, collared. It's a weird like lime green sort of dude. It is a, it's by the brand Sage Harbor, Sag Harbor. I'm guessing Sage Harbor Petite. And it is an extra small. It's a petite extra small. And normally I wouldn't buy this, but it was literally 99 cents. So I was like, you know what? Let's go for it, it's fun. Also from the thrift store, I got this dress, which is kind of crazy. You've got these geometric patterns up here and like more of an animal print down here. It's like straight down fit, which it like is so difficult to get off. And I think I didn't, I didn't check yet, but I may have forgot. Like I put it on and I tried it on, but I think I didn't click the start button and I started it when I meant to end it. So I apologize if there's no try on clip here, but it's just such a hassle to get off. You can basically see it just by doing this because it's just a straight down fit. It hugs your curves, but in between it's loose. So yeah, and it has a little peekaboo in the back. But like the peekaboo is in a place where you can still wear a bra and it won't be seen, which is perfect. So then we got Levi's, which this try on clip is bad. I filmed it before I did anything. I didn't get ready. I was in a t-shirt where not wearing any makeup, but I got these pants and you'll see because I have the before and after of them. They fit great everywhere, but the bottom of it was so weird. It was like flare, but only partially flare. And it was supposed to be ankle or no, it was supposed to be like capri, like mid length. But on me, it was a weird ankle length because I'm so short. But it fit me so well everywhere else. I, I was like, and they were, both the jeans I'm gonna show you were on sale half off, I think, if not even more from Levi's. So they were cheap and I just, I had to. So I cut them so that they're only a tiny bit flared and I made them actually mid capri length on me. And I'm, they'll get more distressed as I wear them, but I just distressed it a little bit with a nail file. And yeah, they're just high-waisted. And then I got another pair of Levi's. They're the same fit, I think, but different like legs. These are a little bit wider in the top, which again, you just, you gotta accept that things are gonna be too big in your waist if you have a big butt. And they are super wide-legged, kind of like the khakis. And they go like still incredibly wide-legged, incredibly distressed. And I might try to like get sandpaper and distress the knees of this a bit too, but I don't know. I really like these. I've never bought anything Levi's before and these were on super sale, so I didn't have to spend a ton of money and I love, I love them. They're still too big in the waist, but that's okay. Honestly, the only jeans I have found fit me perfectly, like waist, butt and everything is um, Abercrombie, which is weird because nobody shops at Abercrombie, but they actually, they fit. I got a red Christmas sweater because it was on sale for $6. So it's just a red, I got an extra large that'd be super big. And it's just a sweater. It's got these little like varsity stripes, but they're shiny and pink and silver. And y'all know me, my Christmas sweaters. Actually, I don't know if you do, but I have 
25 and I'm trying to get up to her 30, 31 because there's 31 days of December to wear a Christmas sweater every day and this is one that can be worn like after Christmas or it's still technically a Christmas sweater but people aren't like why are you wearing a Santa sweater after Christmas but it's red so it still counts and then from Forever 21 I got a pair of biker shorts which y'all I have been looking for biker shorts for so long they had excuse me I was gonna get a pair from Nike or Adidas so they'd be a good quality but they didn't have any, and I was very angry. Like, literally, the lady had to go in the back to get me the normal spandex from Nike. Weird. But I got a pair from Forever 21. They're shiny, which I don't really like, but I'd rather have a shiny pair than no pair, and they were only $10. So, yeah, just a normal pair of biker shorts. I also got this top, which is... And there's a try -on clip of it. You don't need to see it. But it's just a cropped camo shirt. Which, if you know me, you know I have an obsession with camo. I have a camo skirt, camo shorts, camo pants. I have another camo shirt. I have a camo hat. That's all I can think of right now. But I really like camo. I didn't need another one, but it was cheap. It's so comfy. It's cropped. I didn't have one like this. So I got this in a size large because when you have a larger chest and you get something cropped, it's shorter than it's supposed to be because it got to go over your chest. So I always get in a bigger size so that it's not like super duper cropped. It's actually a good length. And then I went to H&M and I got this, which I got it in a super duper big size. I got it in an extra large, which I would have gotten in a large, but I didn't have it. Cause giant t-shirts with biker shorts are mm, amazing. And that's what I wanted to get something to wear with it. So I got this friends men's giant shirt but on it, it's the scene where they're in the beach house and and they covered Joey and Sand and they gave him like boobs. And it's just a really funny scene and I am obsessed with Friends. It's my favorite show ever. I am going to cry in January when it gets taken off of Netflix. <sighs> I'm feisty about that. Anyways, I already have another Friends shirt and a Friends hat, but I needed another one. And then lastly, I went to, I thought it was normal guests. But it was like G by guess and I don't I don't know what that really is but we walked in because we thought it was normal guess didn't really like anything but these were only nine dollars so I got these it's in a size large which because they didn't have a medium it was either a small or a large so I got a large and as you'll be able to see in the clip they're again too big in the waist but they're actually like incredibly tight everywhere else so the medium probably would have been too tight everywhere else so I'm glad that I got the large and they're literally just like, I don't even know what this pattern is, but they're so freaking cool. And they've got these stripes down the side with a light pink, a white and a black and they're like legging fit, but they're thicker so you can wear them as actual pants and not have to like cover your bum. And oh my gosh, it's, it's so, just so cool. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to comment, like, subscribe, do all that nonsense stuff. It's not nonsense. Please do it. It's very helpful. Um, down below. All of that. All of it. Pretty please. I would very much appreciate it. It's a very kind thing to do. Thank you. Yeah, I'm giving you time to do it right now. Yeah, you can go. Just go click. Yeah, good job. Good job. I'm proud of you. Okay, well, that's it. I'll see you guys at some point in time with another video of some sorts. Who knows? We'll see. Let's just end this thing. Bye!